from the Tenke Fungurumu mine in the Katanga. Now, what comes to mind here, it's this this uh, horrible grey to, to, to black matrix, which has a fracture zone of that of quartz. So I wouldn't even say young dolomite. And sitting on that are, the, are these intensely dark green libethanite crystals. Hellishly difficult to photograph. I think you can zoom into the still pictures and you'll find that behind these little pyramids of libethanite you'd have a lawn of calcite and specular hematite, speculara, uh, specular specularite, which is actually hematite is not all that common from the copper deposits of the Katanga. Of course, it does occur. You'd find the associations like uh, pyrite gold, uh, Chalka, pyrite, bornite, etc., but not as abundant as the the copper the the, the uh, copper sulfates or the um, well copper silicates actually not copper sulfates. But anyway, I'm getting a bit uh, lost now. Uh, from a display point of view, this guy has a vase effect. So you let me just see if I can focus in on that. I really struggled when I photographed this guy. It's not a very large piece, uh, under two inches, edge to edge there, across as well. But quite impressive, a lot of bling bling on the, on the say, let's, let's say the flower top across this section. There you can see the little uh, libethnite uh, pyramid sitting right across there. And if you zoom into these sections, you'll actually find behind little calcites with little uh, specular hematites.